And all week long, we've been highlighting local universities as students head back to school. Tonight, SkyCal's Desmond Shaw reports on the humble beginnings for one of the most beautiful campuses in the country. Well, take a look at this stunning university. This, of course, is Pepperdine. It's the home of the Waves, an appropriate mascot as the university is situated on over 800 acres of some of the most prime coastal land in the country. Ironic side note, though, the mascot was chosen long before they were on this Malibu campus. Founded in 1937 by George Pepperdine, a man who made a fortune with a chain of automobile parts and accessories supply stores, he started that company with a mere $5 investment, believe it or not. Pepperdine considered it wrong to build up a fortune only to use it for selfish purposes though and so after only seven months after conceiving the idea of a liberal arts university opened their first campus which was actually in South LA off of Vermont and 79th Street that first year they had 167 uh, students enroll and with the post World War II explosion in higher education enrollment ballooned to almost 2000 by 1949 the university wanted to expand its campus but it was becoming prohibitively expensive so they were looking at new sites and more suburban areas to construct a new campus and they gave serious consideration to Calabasas and West Lake Village, but in 1968, they were offered a donation of over 130 acres here in Malibu by the Adamson Ridge family, who at one point owned most of Malibu. And the first buildings opened here in 1971. So this campus would not have been possible without the help of the Seaver family as well, for which the undergraduate school is named after. They made their fortune in oil drill manufacturing, and they've donated more than $160 million to the university. Many of the buildings were designed by William Pereira. He also designed the LA County Museum of Art and much of the campuses of UC Irvine and USC. And this has been called one of the most beautiful college campuses on the planet because uh, it combines the beautiful architecture with breathtaking scenery of the ocean and the Santa Monica Mountains. Most of the buildings here also highly fire resistant. So in the case of major brush fires, which have definitely threatened the university many times before, students are told to shelter in place instead of trying to evacuate. The Los Angeles campus closed down in 1981, but today Pepperdine also has campuses in West LA, Irvine, Calabasas, and five permanent satellite campuses in different international cities, including London, Florence, and Shanghai. From a $5 investment to a truly world-class campus with local and international satellite campuses, such an incredible story. Best of luck to all the waves in 2024. Taking a look at this from SkyCal, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at lookatthis at cbs.com.